We were in the restaurant business for many years. Enrolled in IIN, which is the Integrative Nutrition School. So I'm learning to be a holistic health coach. Let me so, tell them real quickly how that story worked. Okay. This is really an amazing story, and this is the truth. She had a serious accident in 94 on a moped and crushed her tibial plateau. She had like seven surgeries. She got an antibiotic resistant infection. She was sick. She had fibromyalgia. She was lethargic. And we went through every medical program that we knew of. Acupuncture, massage therapy. We worked with t traditional doctors with medications, pain medications. Uh, went through all kinds of different pain medications that she had eventually get off of. And we ended up finding out through all of this journey that food was the answer. Got her, her energy, came, energy back came back and her pain was dissolved. And it, it was all through food. We were really big into natural anti-inflammatories, Ayurvedic medicine, ginger, turmeric, and there's a whole lot of other kinds of uh, botanicals that are really, really good for treating your body for certain illnesses. My name is Rachel Lang and I'm a certified health coach. My big focus right now is helping to coach people into adopting a plant-based diet. Why plant-based? Because it's one way of really getting the most optimal nutrition in, your, in the diet. Plants, especially green plants, contain the most nutrients on the planet compared to any other foods. So it's really, it's, you get optimal nutrition, you're eating less of them, what they call the macronutrients, like the carbohydrates, the fats, and the proteins, and more micronutrients, which are, which are so crucial for proper cell function. I think really, well, the main thrust of eating this way is eating in a way where we get maximum nutritional punch for whatever we choose to eat. So nutrient density is one of the aims when we eat a plant-based diet. So high nutrient density foods, low calorie foods. And um, then you're really guaranteed of getting all the stuff that your body needs. When you eat this way, it's pre you're practicing prevention. Mm -hmm. The incidence of disease are lessened phenomenally when you're eating a low fat, healthy plant-based diet. My name's John Parsons and I'm the founder and owner of Parsons Training, a uh, personal training and wellness company. I adopted a plant-based diet in 2007. Uh, a friend invited me to a uh, lecture that was being presented um, from a person who was, you know, uh, teaching the benefits of a plant-based diet. And at first, uh, being an owner of a gym and a teacher at a university uh, teaching exercise science, um, where we talk about sports nutrition and how athletes need meat and all these different things, um, I was pretty skeptical when I went to this lecture. Um, following the lecture, I, uh, I, I kind of said, well, you know what, uh, I'll, I'll do it, I'll give it a try. My intentions were initially to prove someone wrong, but what happened to me over the course of six months was amazing. Um, namely, number one, right away, immediately, I began to lose weight. Um, I had struggled with weight my whole life. At one point I weighed 268 pounds and um, <clears throat> adopting a plant-based diet, within six months I weighed 190, but I wasn't a sick 190 because I was working out and I actually found myself having more energy to do so. Um, keep in mind, I'm on a mission to prove someone wrong, right? So um, as I was working out, I found myself not being as sore, not as fatigued during the workouts. And so I kind of liked what was happening. One, we evaluate their diet where they're at. And I ask them the food journal. And then we sit down together and we, we evaluate that diet. And then we start looking at where do you need to add certain foods and what foods at this point are you willing to eliminate. Once we've evaluated their diet and we've made um, we make some modifications. I asked the, cl the client, okay, how far do you want to go right now? Do you want to go 60-40? Right now you're at 50-50. Or do you want to go 80-20? 80% whole food plant-based, oil-free? 20% still have some of those things? Or do you want to go all out? But I do share with them, the quicker you embrace this, the quicker you will win back your health.